Let's see. My car looks fine. Until you get to this side. And you can see where the damage is. You got me good. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a new video. I'm like leaning back as far as I can because my back really hurts from my car accident. So right now at Friday morning is currently 7.34 in the morning and I'm outside of Kaiser waiting to be seen. I was supposed to be at work. But that was awkward. Like I just completely came out of nowhere. Um but I ended up having to call out from work again. Um because when I was shaving down this morning to go to work my back was in flames. Like it hurt so bad. I couldn't get any relief. Any potholes I hit, it just made it ten times worse. So I texted my boss and I was like, hey, sorry, I have to call out again. Um, my back really hurts from the car accident and I have a doctor appointment at 8 o'clock. Or it was originally at 2, but I called them and I was like, I can't wait until 2 to be down here. Is there any way that you guys can get me in earlier? I was supposed to go to Cascade Park, Kaiser, but they're like, the only available appointment is at Simon Creek at 8.40. So I'm currently outside of Simon Creek, Kaiser, and let me tell you, I don't know this hospital the way I know Kaiser, the other one. So this is gonna be fun. Um. They're pretty sure that from what it sounds like, because of the pain that I'm describing, like my back hurts right now, um, that I tricked a muscle, which is not good. <sighs> but a lot of it is because I was tensed up when I hit the dare, like I felt like I was getting tensed up. Um, so yeah, that's fun. Um, I did film a little bit of the damage to my car like earlier yesterday and then today I was walking no I went to go check on the headlight and I walked this side of my car and I have a mud streak from one side of my door to the other like the end of my car so I won't be able to get a car wash for about a month because I can't go through the car wash with my headlight the way it is because it will fall off because of their spinners, so I'm gonna have to wash it by hand, which is, you know, fine. I might see if they'll fix the dent that I have in my car that I must have got at work. So I'm gonna see if they do that, which will be a little bit more than what they're expecting. Or I can just leave it and let them clean it off when they fix my car. Um, but. Yeah, I just have to sit here and wait until 8.15 and then I'll go in. So I got a little bit of time to kill. Just waiting in my car. Like, I don't think she expected me to go home and then come back out because I live 30 minutes outside of town. And to drive up with only ibuprofen in my system because I ended up having to take some so I imagine trying to kill this pain, um, it was not fun, and I have no idea where I'm going in this hospital, so I wanted to get here before 8, like, right at 8, and go in and get that checked out, get my back checked out. My head hurts a little bit, I have a little bit of a headache, but I think it's more or less because I didn't sleep last night, so... I'm hoping today, like, if they say just go home and take it easy, like, you can rest. I think I overdid it yesterday after it, because I also moved around my room. But I felt the energy, like, I felt fine yesterday, and then today it's just, my back really hurts. And I think this is what happened last time where I hit my head on my steering wheel, and I have... Hold on, there's a car pulling in next to me. Oh, this is awkward. This is very awkward. But I will let you guys go, and I will see you later on, and I'll update you guys. Alright guys, it is currently, hold on, 322. 
I have been home for a couple hours. I kind of like just relaxed and took a little break. Um, so when I went to the doctor, they prescribed me with naproxen again, um, just to help with the back pain. Like it's pretty bad from what they said that they're pretty sure I just pulled a muscle from when I got hurt. Um, so I've been watching TV, just relaxing, sitting up straight, trying to relieve some pressure off my back because it hurts. The only bad thing about that, I have a profit, like, so naproxen is, like, the highest level of anti-inflammatory in pain medicine that you can go. So they gave me the 500s, again, which I've already had those. I had them back when I injured my shoulder because that was the only thing that would kill the pain, like, the, in the shoulder. So, <sighs> it's been interesting. Um... But yeah, I've been working on blogs, getting those done, getting July planned, prepped, planned, prepared for, and then, yeah, pretty much just relaxing. Found out that we got paid today. Didn't know that we were going to get paid today. I thought we weren't going to get paid until Sunday night, so it was kind of nice to find out that I got paid today. Um, but yeah, they said I should be good to go in like four days. But to give them a call if it's not even better. Because I can't really call out again on Monday. I will have to go to work. So I'm hoping it will be better. If not, I can always use an ice pack that my work has to try to help relieve the pain. So, yeah. The only problem is, like, when you're in that 12-hour stretch, because you have to take these every 12 hours or 10 hours, it usually wears off about 11 and a half hours, maybe 11, depending on it. And it's already wrote off. And I still have three more hours, into, or four more hours, no, seven more hours until I can take another dose of it. And it lasted for about four hours. So I'm hoping by this weekend I can get my back cleared up and be able to feel better. Um, I did notice, like, when I got out... And I was walking back from my work to get back in my car. I have a mud streak from one side of my door to another side of my door. I think I said this in the last clip, but I wasn't sure. So yeah, that's gross. So I think I'm just going to take it easy this weekend and just relax and hopefully feel better. So I will see you guys later on tonight. Happy Saturday guys, it is currently 1.47 p.m. and I'm finally checking in for the day. I don't know how many clips I'm going to do today. Um, so this morning I woke up around 8 o'clock and I was in sure enough back pain which I was fully expecting it to be quite bad um, today. So today is day two of it. Um, actually day three of it. So, I think I have one more day and then I should be feeling better. So, hopefully by tomorrow I'll feel better. But, definitely can tell that I can't be on my feet for a long period of time because then I start to really feel it in my lower back and whatnot. And I went to the store, but the store, like, all the craziness, like, it had to be up and walking around in the store. Got what we needed, came back out here, and people are still driving like idiots. I don't know how much clearer people have to realize, like, the deer are out right now, and they're being mad hatters. That they're being really aggressive towards people, like, cars and all that. And people just need to slow down and take that extra time to give people time to stop. But... I'm just going to relax, watch SmackDown, work on blogs, get that done, and then probably take a nap. Sounds pretty good to me. So, I have a couple more hours until I can take another doses, da, 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 dose, da, dose of this painkiller. And what's sad is the one I took this morning didn't really kick in. It still hasn't, and I'm still on... Like, quite a bit of pain, but I think I overdid it this morning when I went to Walmart, so that could 
that probably didn't help me. But I will check in with you guys later. Bye guys. Hey guys, happy Sunday. I only filmed that one clip yesterday and that's because my back really started hurting like around 2 and it went from 2 to the time I went to bed and then this morning I didn't fully wake up with back pain but by the time I went to go to my business and the bedroom that's when it started hurt and uh, it's been kind of hurting a little bit off and on today it seems to be doing better so I'm hoping like t tomorrow I'll be fine like I'll be back to normal and whatnot so hopefully I just have today and that's it like I have to go back to work tomorrow so that's gonna be fun tomorrow because they told me that I can't lift anything over 50 pounds like I'm supposed to take it easy for a couple of days more days and hopefully by that time it's back to normal so I will see you guys later Hi guys, so it's the end of the night and it's time for me to say goodnight. It's currently 8.47 at night. I'm currently charging my watch so I'm waiting for my watch to get done. And then I also filmed my planner with me. So that will be up next week. Not this Monday, but next Monday. And then, um, I moved around my car because I have to move it around so I can get out tomorrow. And then, yeah, I'm just taking the rest of the day to relax because my back is on fire because I put away laundry like I should have known better not to put it away but I can't um I don't like to watch, look at clothes all week uh, I mean like there's quite a bit of laundry that I need but that's gonna wait for another day and then yeah so I will see you guys tomorrow or not tomorrow. I'll see you guys next weekend for a new weekend vlog. And I'll also will see you tomorrow for a lunch vlog. Maybe we'll see if I have enough energy to do next lunch vlog for this upcoming week. Bye guys.